part of history being made here in Hawaii. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're chanting on the Hokulea now. What are they doing over there now? Um, just visitors going on. So people, I guess, pre-signed up for the ticket to go on board. Oh, okay. How so much we, are the tickets? Oh, we can't. It's full. So oh, yeah. we're just going to have to do photos from the side here, which is fine. Oh really? Yeah. Okay. And this is the Hawaii Convention Center. So this is where you were talking about coming down the stairs right here, right? This is the back side of the Hawaii Convention Center. And this is everybody waiting to get onto the Hokulea. Come down here. This is the first time we've been down here on this side of the Alawa. Oh, yeah. The first time ever. So, what time are you going on with this thing? Um, we're, we're actually just, we, our crew has already been on, so we're oh, just covering just the Explorers Club. Oh, okay. It's a newly minted Hawaii chapter. Okay. So, Nancy, what do you think? Really nice. And everything here goes toward the Polynesian Voyaging Society. Anything they make on the boat, right? Yeah, you need it. Hey, you are so amazing. I don't know how many days they've been doing this. Tours or the sailing? Uh, the tours, basically. Yesterday, today, and tomorrow. I wish I could have been down here to hop on there to get it under the bridge. Yeah, they need a lot of bodies to do that. Ah, okay, there's somebody that's got information. So everything that's made on this over here goes toward the Polynesian Voyaging Society, correct? Into the maintenance and when they take it down to Sand Island and all that stuff. Were you on the cruise itself? Uh, I did three legs. How does, one, how does one get a ticket or a tour? How does that work? So up the top of the stairs, uh -huh. they're having people sign waivers. And oh, okay. then you just, they'll stamp your hand and then they'll bring people down in groups. Oh, okay, fantastic. So it's about so, 30 minutes through. And yeah, but isn't there a charge up there for no. this? To get, oh, no. oh, that's fantastic. Yeah. That's great. It's amazing they had to take these masks down to get underneath the bridge coming to the Alawai. The Alawai Bridge going right under Kalakaua Avenue or Alamoana Boulevard just to get it under the bridge. And it had to sail all the way down the Alawai. You can see this bridge. That's the bridge right there that they had to come under. So they had to pack like 55 people. On top of taking down the mast, they have to load a whole bunch of people and at low tide. Low tide was this morning somewhere around 4 o'clock in the morning. That's when all the people had to jump on the Hokulea to weigh it down to get it as low as they could possibly get it. And apparently they got to do that again. In order to get it out of here, they got to wait for low tide again. But these are all the people that are waiting. Now, in order to get on for the tour, you have to go up to the convention center up on the third floor and you have to sign a waiver. And when you sign that waiver, you come down with a ticket and then you stand in line to go on the tour. And the tour is going to be going on for till Wednesday. So, all of these people here, they signed their waivers and now they're waiting to get on a little bit of voyaging history on the famous Hokulea. One more good quick shot. Hey Nancy. Watch now. No, I don't need to. 
Okay, here we go. Okay, I'm a little train that says I think I can. I think I can. I don't know how many stairs there are right here. Okay. So far, so good. I made it this far. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go, we got some more stairs to climb. And away we go. A little bit further to go. Here we go. Far so good. Oh, this is a climb. What's the name of that song, The Climb? was up here. We got all kinds of stuff going on up here. Aren't you glad you don't have to come up and down those stairs? I do sometimes. <laughs> they should give you hazardous pay when you do that. <sighs> that was a lot. Yeah, they're really, and they're super light. And her pockets. Jerry Lopez. Well, there's a famous name here in Hawaii, Jerry Lopez. Super famous for fun place, Kualoa Ranch. You can't beat this place for fun. Remember, uh, remember the dinosaur movie? These are the guys that caught the dinosaur out of Kualoa. Jurassic World, you're talking about Jumanji, um, the, uh, Palm Skull II, Island, Pearl Harbor. all of those 51st seats are just some of them. But yeah. aside from all of our Hollywood uh, friendship and, uh, and, and collaboration we have, Kulo is very uh, culturally strong, significant area. Oh, I share with you some of the stories, one of which is Kanehoalani, the most highest point in all of Kulo that I guarantee was used during celestial navigation. I also want to share with you a story of Kahahana, who at one time was selected by the Council of Oahu Kahuna to be the Mo'i of Oahu. Oh. He was raised by Kahikili, hence Kahikili Highway. Highway. And then the last one I want to share with you is Kaha'i. Kaha'i Ohohokamali'i, who was a grandson of Mo'i Keha, who was a very famous navigator, Ho'okele, that would travel back and forth from Kahiki to Hawaii as we celebrate Malamohonua. This is why we concentrated on these three stories on behalf of Kuala. Fantastic. And look at him. He's learning all this stuff right here. I just saw him look intently. <laughs> you go to Kualoa Ranch, you not only get ATVs and horseback rides and good stuff like that, but you get an education on Hawaiiana. See, thank you guys. I appreciate that. Aloha. We'll see you on YouTube. Can I color you like this, Uncle? No. Okay. This is where you register. If you want to go on that little tour on the Hokulea downstairs, you have to come up here and register. You have to sign a waiver.
merchandise. They got a lot of the shirts, all the t-shirts. The things are looking around. Here, a different shirts. Nama Hawaii, Nama Hawaii, Nama Hawaii, Hawaii. Beautiful t shirt design. Um, these are math cards for the children. Um, they learn constellations. Oh, okay. Yeah. This is the beginning. They're two years old, so they begin learning constellations. Oh, at two, two years old. old. Oh, that's early learning. Boy, and we thought five years old in kindergarten was too late. The way we actually present it is that the children match the pictures first. Uh -huh. So it's a free language skill. So oh, we have yeah. them match the pictures. Right. Then once they've matched that, then we introduce the names of the constellations. Oh, okay. So once they do that activity, they match and then they learn the names of the constellations. Then they play a memory game with the discs. Oh, you know, yeah, we're a little yeah, yeah. memory games that we play yeah. with cards. It's the same idea. So our school is dual language, so they learn how to read and write and, and First. So, oh, okay. so it's done in Papua New Guinea, and then the children learn all of the constellations. Did you start at two years old? <laughs> <laughs> What you doing up here? Hey, so we are here with the uh, Pui Malama po Ponua people. Okay. Oh, who yeah. just, they, they just told me I want this hydroponic system. So we came up here to pick this up right now. Really? Yeah. No, so she's kidding. teaching us how to use it. No, so, so yeah. Hydroponic. So what do you do? You so just I, like... I plan to turn my living room into an eco-friendly environment. Yeah? Yeah. Your living uh, room is big enough to put all that? Oh, yeah. Just, oh. just we gotta keep them on the down yeah, low because my sister, car. my sister don't know we're bringing this home yet. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody who sees this on YouTube, they gotta find you on what channel? Um, what station? Well, you can catch me on um, ESPN 1420 or NBC Sports Radio or um, FM 100, or 96, just, you know. Okay. Or you can see his puppy on the family, yeah. right? Or find me on Instagram at milguy, L-I-L-G-U-Y-808. All right. Yeah. Fantastic. All my social media sites all got the same name. Fantastic. Aloha. Guy just won the free aquaponics system. I know, he system. just told me. I know, isn't that exciting? So he won this system from Hui Malama Honua. Uh -huh. And it was because we're collecting a database of Hawaii residents that we want to be able to do some future surveys with so oh, we can really? understand our community interests and needs better. gotta have better. Hawaiian blood. No! Gotta be Hawaii residents. Oh, Hawaii. Uh, you had your weeds at one time <laughs> when I was emceeing the Kamehameha Day Parade. Exactly. Where do you get all your suits from? Yeah, this is America. If you're looking something, you can find it. No, guy, this guy is amazing. When I, did, when I was emceeing the Kamehameha Day Parade, he came by with a suit like this, all with grass leaves all over. I mean, marijuana suit. The whole suit was marijuana. Where are you from? I'm from Poland. From Poland? Yes. My wife is Polish. Yeah, my wife is Polish and is sitting over there. I can show you. Oh, yeah. And where do you buy your suits from? This is uh, from Amsterdam. Oh, Amsterdam. Yeah. Oh, yeah, they like grass. Yeah, this is the custom made. Really? 
And what is your name? My name is Andy. If you forget my name, call police, they know me. Okay, or Amos and I call police, they know me. <laughs> Good seeing you, Andy. Okay. Yeah, I remember you from... Hi. What are you doing here? So this is the Hawaiian Star Compass. Uh -huh. So this is basically like a, a smaller version of the one that's located outside. Oh, okay. And we use this to teach the next generation on the different stars and the different houses that they're all located in. And how to navigate. Yes, so like the basic navigation tool. Okay. And your company is... Kanehunamoku. Oh, all right. Right here. And they teach you how to navigate. This is great. They've got the big uh, woven one outside. Yes. Showing about the same thing. Yes. This is good. Well, thank you so much. Appreciate it. <laughs> I think this is the registration for the boat tour. Everybody that wants to get on the Hopalaya tour, I think this is the, the line here for it. Let's go find out how to register for this. on the waivers to get on this. It's called the registration, but actually it's just a waiver. Some people said there's a charge for it, but it's not. Hi, so you guys are good. Hi. This is where you register, right? Yes. Okay, and it's, it's just a waiver. It's actually for a waiver. Yeah, just so a waiver. So the registration is done. So right. in case you fall off the side of the boat, yes. you know? Yes. Okay, mahalo. You're welcome. Okay, so that's how it works, okay? Yes. So we're climbing the stairs. You just got to come up here and get a waiver. And then what they'll do is you got to stand in a little bit of a line back there. But that's okay, because it looks like the line is going fast. And then they'll take you downstairs, right here. They'll take you down to the tour. As a matter of fact, let's take a walk down here now. This is what you have to go through for the waiver. Now. Okay, so there's no elevators down. You got to take the stairs down. So if you're physically fit, then it's good to do this. But if not, uh, you're out of luck, I guess. Okay. And if you missed it, the convention center has so much information and so many things to do. It's not just the Hokulea, it's not just the boat. I mean, it's the whole deal where you can get information, you can buy t-shirts, they've got products, they've got food up here, they've got snacks, just everything. And it's, it's a beautiful convention center here in Honolulu, Hawaii. Everybody's getting on the world of the Polynesian Voyaging Society's Hokulea sailed around the world just by guiding themselves by the stars. Now that's navigation at its finest game. Oh, you look like a Rocky movie here. <laughs> what, you're not gonna try it too? He's trying to show off. Da -da -dun, da -da -dun, da -da -dun, da -da okay, now jump up and down. Da -da -dun, da <laughs> now watch, he's gonna drink up everything when he gets to the top. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Don't tell me you got to go up and down all day long. My gosh. How long is this going to be going on until the Wednesday, right? Tuesday. Just Tuesday. tomorrow. Just tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Take care. Okay. I'm going to take the safe way down. I'm going to hold on to the rail. When you're hanging onto a camera and walking down all these steep stairs, it's a smart thing to do to hang onto the rail. I learned a lot from those guys up there. Matter of fact, I didn't know they had all that stuff up there. And for them to explain, like the guy from Kualoa Ranch, when he was explaining everything there and all the movies that were taken at Kualoa Ranch, it was pretty cool. Let's 
Okay, we're just now leaving the Hokulea. I had a good time. I went upstairs and I saw the vendors and all the information that they had on the Hokulea. But that was really cool being on that boat right there. That's the boat that went around the world. Famous Hokulea. Okay, that does it for this segment, gang. Uh, hope to see you next time. I hope you're enjoying more tours around the island. And uh, I'll talk to you later. Okay, bye-bye.